Welcome to a short Roland Rambles. I want to talk about uh, an idea that I have and some thoughts that I have regarding Kamala Harris and her campaign. The thing that is bugging me the most is I don't understand how Kamala Harris thinks anything that she's doing is going to work. Like, who was smoking it up really, really hard when they came up with the ideas for what she's going to campaign on? Uh, and I get, believe it or not, I get the most up-to-date news about this by looking at the politics board on 4chan's Telegram aggregator that only posts threads that get 300 or more replies. The number of shill bots that post the same stupid thing, the same general stupid topic over and over and over again, and then spam with a bunch of different one post by this ID bots saying the same general sentiment at the top of every thread tells me all I need to know. It's astonishing how much astroturfing has gone into this stinking campaign. I mean, I, I see things like um, weird memes, obviously forced memes posted to the politics board saying Kamala is brat and I don't know what that means then I have to go look it up and I find out oh, Kamala is brat it, it comes from where uh, Charlie XCX did some song about like a brat summer uh, basically just, uh, I don't know, strong independent women misbehaving or whatever summer, I don't know uh, and, and oh, Kamala is brat said Charlie XCX on Twitter X, whatever. And it's just, I don't even know what that means. Like, what are you, what is the point? You're going on a board full of people who know a lot about politics and drop a whole lot of curse words all the time and talk trash about everyone to everyone else. You're doing that, and you think that somehow you're going to push this, this narrative somehow. Like, oh, look at the politics board on 4chan. It's totally flipped for Kamala Harris. Like, no, that's never going to happen. Uh, people are going to yell at each other no matter what you do. So it doesn't matter if the politics board on 4chan seems to be astroturfedly supporting Kamala Harris with only the top posts in every single heavily replied to thread. <laughs> it's not going to make a difference. I don't get it, though. And it, even if it did, even if it did, Let's just go over the list of these things that I've observed bubble up to the top. <clears throat> the Kamala is brat thing. Well, it's supposed to imply that she's like uh, young and identifies with the young, the young women, you know, that demographic that, um, that often doesn't vote, but when they do, they swing elections. You know, oh, those basically trying to appeal to college girls. Um, We've got, let's see, uh, and there's, there's so many that I just sort of broke down and forgot. Um, Kamala is brat really is the, the highest one in my mind all the time because it was so stupid. There's like a thing where Kamala takes someone in a wheelchair and dumps them off a cliff. And, and that's supposed to be a meme. And it just says, Kamala, brat. And it just dumps some old guy out of a wheelchair. I, it, I don't even remember who it was but you get the idea. So Kamala is brat. But then we have um, all of these posts saying that uh, you're, you're alone because you're a loser. There's a lot of this like demoralizing men thing. I guess the idea is all these Trump supporting incels, well, go to 4chan poll and tell them that they're miserable, lousy people and, um, you know, demoralize them so that they feel like their vote doesn't matter. Um, and, and there's a whole lot of that shilling that's gone on. It, it, it's astonishing. Here, look, <clears throat> let's do it live. Let's do it live. If I pull this up, and the reason that I'm making this video is actually I'm thinking about doing a daily segment where I just drop a short video every day going over the trends that I've noticed in the shilly, astroturfy, totally bought and paid for uh, BS on 4chan. So let's see. Poll humor. Well, poll, uh, there's nothing there. We can't come back from this. Even deportations won't fix it. And uh, it's saying almost half of 6 to 21-year-olds in the U.S. are Hispanic, African-American, or Asian. Uh, the population decline thing. So they try to emphasize, ha-ha, white, white people uh, will be gone soon. Remember, it's not happening. When we talk about great replacement theory, it's not happening. And it's good that it's happening. Um, and if you, if you wonder... Um, it's good that it's happening because we can't come back from this. Who's we? Presumably white people. Let's see. What else? Um, 
that's actually long, so that's probably not it. Uh, something about Russia. How can the white man retain his dignity? Now, this is what I'm talking about. So we've already had one, um, the most recent one, that says, hey, white people, guess what? Uh, all the young people are, uh, half the young people aren't white. Ha, 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 ha. Then we've got this guy in a, in a Colonel Sanders outfit. How can the white man retain his dignity? Recent date night outfit, blah, blah, blah. And it's got some, like, outfit that's supposed to be embarrassing. So it, there's two white people, uh, great replacement demoralization type threads. Let's see what else. Uh, some Israel nonsense, some cringe. Let's see, nothing, no, there's no trend here. Um, sometimes you have to go through because there are legitimate discussions laced in here. China yelling at Israel. Oh, here we go. Incels are committing suicide in mass in America. That's how bad things are. And, and there's like, a, I don't know, probably a Reddit post. Oh God, it is it is a Reddit post. Yep, did I call that one or what? Incels are committing suicide in mass in America. So, <clears throat> uh, hey, white people, you know, all the youth are turning not white. And hey, white people, you have no dignity. And hey, uh, uh, incels, you know, notice that all of these are the demographics that vote more overwhelmingly for Trump in general. Um, hey, incels, um, you're all dying because you're losers. And let's see, what's the next one? Um, Internet Archive. What race are you in on? Why did it fail? Yeah, so those are probably just legitimate BS threads, whatever. I mean, let's be honest, everything's BS threads. Pick related going viral. Men and women have completely different views. Um, yep, this is another one. This is actually a more cleverly done one. This guy just became a father and is having a meltdown because his wife won't touch his dick and even sympathizes with cheaters. Sounds like the most immature gay thing I have read in my life, but apparently the majority of men think he is right, so who is in the wrong? So, <clears throat> so yet another like demoralization thread. Hey, losers on 4chan, demoralize. Let's see. Do y'all ever feel bad for Native Americans? We stole their land. Another race one. Do you see what I mean? And uh, this is all October 11th, and I'm recording this on October 11th. So these are all threads from today. We already have like five or six uh, threads that have something to do with race or otherwise just generally with the demographic of Trumpy Trump supporters. And it's funny how this becomes a trend, isn't it? Uh, let's see, Finnish banks not doing English, some pastor don't care. <clears throat> Is it true that the founder of Islam was a pedophile? Um, now, nah, let's see. And I don't care when it's like a one-off post like that. I care when I notice that for some reason, um, there are a lot of those posts that say the same thing, that somehow are getting up to hundreds of replies. Why is it these posts are so active? Because bots, that's why. Bots and rage bait. Let's see. <clears throat> um, <laughs> Univision accidentally broadcast proof that Kamal used a teleprompter to down all. Uh, and here we go again. Hard times are coming for white females. White women, white girls. Not only are the white women... Uh, I, I can't say a lot of this stuff on YouTube. But yeah, hard times are coming for white females. So again, another race bait thread. Uh, give me one reason why I shouldn't marry a trad black queen. Uh, here's a, what's your first encounter with a person of trans orientation? We'll say, um, there's yet another Jew thread. Those get old. Um, let's see. Um, here we go. Here's another one that's it's very sneakily hidden. White men are responsible for 33% of the rapes in Korea despite being a very tiny minority, under 1%. Must read article. And of course, I, I don't know where it is, but it sure does look like Reddit. And the 4chan thread post is, is despite being one less than 1% of the population, how do you explain the 1 out of 33 phenomenon? So again, it's another white people bad, white people demoralized, why are white people so bad? Let's see. Indians are overwhelming American HR departments. Yet, yet another, brown people are successful, white people are failures. Right? 
and it keeps happening. Now, some of it could be Trumpy Trumper supporters trying to say that, oh, you know, I'll look, look at all these brown people that are doing better than us and shouldn't be. But I have a hard time believing that considering how many of these are hitting and uh, hitting over 300 replies. And that's the problem is that it's bot fueled artificial garbage. None of this is organic because there's too much of it. Poll on 4chan does not discuss the same stupid thing over and over and over this much. They just don't. So, let's see. I'm ethnically Jewish. We don't care. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, here we go. You should have heard the crowd when he said this. It was literally deafening. Here we go again. This one is also a covert like one race better than another thing. Obama takes credit for the booming economy under Trump by breaking 911 on Twitter. <clears throat> uh, blah, 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 blah. Obama took credit for the Trump economy, basically. But why is someone posting that on 4chan and having it get a whole bunch of engagement? Um, and here, let's do it. Let, let's go ahead and do this one. Let's go in depth. All right, we're going to go in depth. And by in depth, I mean read like the first 10 things. <clears throat> he also said Melania, like most Democrats, support abortion. LMAO, Trump, BTFO, that's, that's um, counting OP, that's three anti-Trump at the top of this thread. They, they sure are posting fast. Um, let's see, 32, um, yeah. So the first post was like two, a minute and a half after. The, the second post was uh, literally like 30 seconds after. They're coming pretty quick. So that's, that's three anti-Trumps. The economy sucked for eight years under Obama. Uh, so it didn't take long to get one positive Trump one. But then another anti-Trump. Growth slowed under Trump. Um, you, you get the idea. There's, there's a whole bunch of uh, bots right at the top of the thread punching the exact same thing. I just don't have time to go through it all. So anyway, if you've made it this far, I'm, I assume that this is a topic that interests you. And what I want to know from you, leave it in the comments below. I might also put a poll on my YouTube community page. Should I, and I'll possibly backdate and go do it a few weeks back, should I do a daily segment where every day, uh, every like morning or whatever, you know, East Coast time, I go over the BS artificial astroturfed, obviously uh, shilled, botted to death, fake ass 4chan uh, postings. Like what are the, what are today's botted, shilled, astroturfed, obviously paid for by some political campaign or someone with an agenda, 4chan thread trends? Is that something you'd be interested in? A quick 4chan poll review in the morning? Like who, who do we think is shilling this time? Because I think that it's very interesting because I've been following 4chan for a very long time. I've actually been on 4chan since 2006, which makes me an old homosexual. Um, I can't say the real word on YouTube because censorship. Oh no, advertisers don't like that word. So if that's interesting to you, please let me know and I will start doing it. I would be happy to do it. Maybe I'll do it anyway, just to see how the interest goes. Daily 4chan poll AstroTurf updates. And I could use a snappy name for it too. AstroTurf related would be cool. Anyway, thanks for listening. You know, let me know. Take care.